Don't drink and drive, folks. That's the big message tonight. There's a, there's a DUI lawyer commercial. I, I don't work in the day. My show's not on. Home all day. First of all, every ad is geared toward the fact that you are a loser at home in search of a career. I didn't know that. Like, every ad is, are you at home right now? <laughs> Laying around, hungover, weed on the table. You want to change all that? <laughs> and I think maybe I could go to DeVry. They say it's not too late. <laughs> this DUI lawyer, like, it must be so rampant. They have a commercial. He's got the fake jail bars. <laughs> and he goes, I'm the best goddamn DUI lawyer out there. You call me before it's too late. I'm like, yeah. <laughs> Wait, I don't get it. I call you before I get a DUI? <laughs> It's like an awkward call. Hey, what's up? <laughs> it's noon. Uh, I just, I'm going out later. I didn't even drink, but I realized I'm going to jail. <laughs> they have checkpoints. Checkpoints are bad when you're drunk. I mean, one time I drank and drove. Drove and drank. One time. And it was a mistake, but I was horrified because I was in traffic at 3 a.m. on sunset, which usually doesn't happen. So I'm almost home like, ah, ah, ah. And then it's traffic and I'm always selfish in traffic. I'm like, there better be an accident up here. There better be a pile of dead bodies. What's happening? Like, this is slow. And the gross feeling when you realize you're in a DUI checkpoint, I go, what are the lights? Oh fuck, is this a DUI checkpoint? No, no, no. No, I can't be here. Hey, I'm drunk. I'm the last person. Back it up. Back it up. I'm boxed in. Go, go, go. Hey, if we work together as a team, we can get me out of here to safety. Come on. No one's helping me. And then I do the U-turn. Ooh. You know what? A U-turn is a signed confession, you know? No cops believe. You're like, it's chilly. Maybe I'll get my windbreaker. You know. I'm so old, when I grew up, we didn't have DUIs. This is when America was great. Can you imagine not worrying about it at all? Oh, it was just music to my dad, because he was a super drunk. You know what I mean? <laughs> we would come home from dinner, and he's like, there we go. <laughs> he's hitting dogs and mailboxes, like anything in his way. And then, beep, beep, beep. And it's a different conversation, cop walks up. Hey, did you know? Oh my God, I didn't know you were shit-faced. I'm sorry. And my dad's like, yeah, beat it, Mom. He's like, no, I thought you were having a seizure. You're just hitting so many things. He's like, I know, rah, 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 get lost. And he goes, listen, maybe if you just took one beer out of one of your hands, it would just help. And he goes, oh, take it under consideration. Yeah. And he goes, no, no, I'm just brainstorming and throwing. And meanwhile, we're in the back like, because we're flying around, I'm Garfield on the window. <laughs> Little helmet on.